black and unapologetic. That's what this artist, Usman Alvin, is saying with his traveling debut solo exhibition featuring emotive and realistic paintings at the Thought Pyramid Art Center in Lagos. Black, proud and loud, with 20 figurative paintings to prove this as created by artist Usman Alvin for his solo exhibition at the Thought Pyramid Art Center in Lagos. is actually a series of dark skin, dark skin figures, African figures that are mostly carrying the dark skin of an African. So I actually present dark skin because we as African, we, we've, we've been, we are, there's this stereotype, bias stereotype about the dark skin that we Africans with dark skin, we look so inferior. And the society has always perceived us as the lesser being in the society. So me as an artist, I try to create an awareness with my paintings that we as black people, we are bold, we are strong, we are, we are beautiful, and we should be unapologetic about that as Africans. The characters flaunt their dark skin, standing tall and embracing the richness of culture depicted in some works of art, which show family ties, strength and resilience of Africans. One of my works titled No Greed no gui it, uh, it's it's the slogan for 2024 the year 2024 like as a black person as an as a nigerian we should be resilient we should be hard working and we should not feel less of ourselves so nobody should intimidate us nobody should make us feel less so a title that that particular painting no gui for anybody like minds are two females that are bind with bonds. They are like they are like sisters, and uh, the the white line on them it's actually the connection between them. So that is actually my style of painting. So the the white line is actually the connection between the two figures. So I title them like minds because they have similarities as one. With this exhibition, the artist is encouraging people of color to embrace what they have been divinely blessed with and not think of changing tones. The connection of the lines is very uniquely different. It's distinctly different to him. I don't, I've not seen any piece like this before. So for arts, we look at things that are very, very different. So looking at his works, the lines as connected the dots and in art you have to connect the dots. So that's very key. In my Recent works now, I try to paint more figurations because I, I like figurations a lot because I'm actually a portrait artist. So, you know, beauty, they say, is in the eyes of the beholder. So, me painting dark skin was not actually enough for me. So, I just find a way to manipulate the, 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 the finished work in my own way. That's what I see as aesthetics. His work is an examination of the different forms of shapes and the thinking that lies behind it. Figures, white lines and more have been explored in ranging media from watercolors, pastel, poster colors, acrylics and charcoal.